folks, uh, Sunday, miserable Sunday, it's been, the rain's cap off, it was here early, very early, but all day it's cap off, it's been cold and miserable looking, dull, uh, I believe it's some part, if not the tail end of some of that uh, storm that uh, we had, uh, Storm Sutton would be like Storm Bernie or something, I don't fucking know. Anyway, just just made it miserable today. So this video really just to catch up. Um for those that sort of said, yeah, I'm in for the next uh, video project we're doing about the, the greeting and hugging each other. Um if just a reminder to do the the few second or so video and uh, get it to me so we can put it all together. I've got two at the moment coming. Um, it'll take quite a few to to do the video, I think. So yeah, those that want to do it, if you can do that, and uh, if you look at the video one or two before this one, I think it's two or so. That would give you the gen on it anyway. So, usual start to a video. Cup of tea. Very crafty to this one. I drunk most of it before I started the bloody video. <laughs> that way I thought I'm going to get a bloody hot cup of tea. And that's practically bloody cold again. Just a mac tea that stayed hot. That's what I want, and I did have one. I need a bloody cup that stays hot, and I did have. I did have a USB one. Where the hell that went? I must get one. Anyway, next bit. I've been doing this uh, hot curry. Look at and whatever. And I thought today I'd do one, but rather than looking at somebody else's, I'll look at mine. Um, and I must admit, I did this sort of a packet. Um, I'm going to have a look at a recipe, see what actually is in this thing. Um, put, put it together myself and doctor it around. But it's uh, um, the spicy... Buffalo wings, or some of the other. You cook the wings and then you put the spicy stuff on, toss it around, and you end up with this looking thing. But rather than chicken wings, I used chicken breast cut up into wing sizes. And it's very nice. Very tasty, but the heat is, I don't know what it's supposed to be like on chicken wings, but it wouldn't make the toes curl, put it out of it. <coughs> it's, uh, it's very mild, but tasty. So, excuse me. This chicken. Yeah, anybody that likes spicy with just that little hint of something in there, it's really nice, really tasty. Um, I'm going to make my own powder up and I'm going to put some flipping ump into it. So when I do that, I'll probably do another one and you can see me suffer. <laughs> <laughs> this would have been alright. When I put it in the bowl and tossed it around, I should have put some of my very hot sauce in and tossed it in with it. It would have looked just the same, but it would have had some flipping on to it. In the process of doing that, when I fried the chicken, I had a little bit of oil left and um, thought, do something else. Now, this is a bit contradictory. 
because the next one I made is sort of vegetarian. But if you want to do this vegetarian, then obviously don't do it in the oil that you cook your chicken in. Just put fresh oil in. Um, so I cut the butternut squash into sizes, put them into the hot oil and cooked it, put a lid on, kept turning them until it was cooked through. So this is hot spicy buffalo butternut squash butternut squash wings. <laughs> but I don't think they have wings. Anyway, this is what it looks like. There's a big chunk of butternut squash. It's got lovely colour on it. Cooked it into the bowl. The powder onto it. Yeah, but it could toss about. So let's have a see what these taste like. Mmm, these actually are flipping lovely. If you want the vegetable alternative to the chicken wings, butternut squash cut into pieces that size and fry them with a, a lid on Keep turning them so that you get that lovely colour on there. Once they're soft enough, take them out into a bowl, put your powder on. Yeah, let it gorgeous. And, mmm, I think I'm going to enjoy those better than the chicken. And I'm not a vegetarian. So if you're a vegetarian and you like a little bit of spice, that is flipping lovely. And you don't really need a recipe. Cut it into big sections, into a little bit of oil, into a pan, put a lid on, keep tossing it around. Cooked out, put your wing uh, powder on it. Gorgeous. Yeah. Mmm. Yeah, very, very tasty that. Anyway, <clears throat> Dracula. It, the legend rises. I might have uh, mentioned this the other day, but I've watched it and it's sort of in the vein of uh, the old um, Ammer House of Horror, very much like that. Um, yeah, it's very much like that. Sort of, I don't know whether the, these are supposed to have a little bit of comedy in, in them or what, I don't know. But it's the Bram Stoker story. It goes off in it on its own tangent a bit. Um, there's a little bit of naughty stuff in it. For those that like naughty stuff. A little bit of horror whacking with a a thing but we'll tell you one little thing I don't, I don't know whether it was in the original book I don't think it was because it I, I, I read that when I was about 16 16 17 a lot of years ago and since then all the films I've seen have never done it but Dracula when he comes flying in on his Prey flew in as an owl. <laughs> now I might be wrong. 
you're probably going to tell me, yeah, he often does that and he does it in the book, but I can't remember it and I can't remember ever seeing it. So, yeah, it, it goes off in its own, own tangent. Um, I, don't, I don't think it really covers the book for me. You'd need another one of these uh, for me to do it. Maybe even another two, I don't know. But that might be me. But it's still a good film, it's a good film to watch. Especially if you like Ama House of Horror. Um, it isn't Ama House of Horror. It's by... Agento! Agento! Who supposedly does really good films. But that's why I said I don't know if they're a bit tongue-in-cheek or what. Anyway, that's that. Only other little bit of news really I got is uh, mundane really. Uh, in my passage I had the usual light and then I went to a, a lower lead light which brought it down a little bit. Same wattage but brought it down a little bit. Today, I'll put a picture up or something, I, I bought one of the antique bulbs that are made to look antique. They have the, the spiral filament inside that you can see and they look very antique. Anyway, put one of them in there, made all the difference. From white it's gone to a, a sort of, I don't know, um, biscuity, not orange, biscuity sort of colour, you'll see anyway. which in my place has made it look pretty flipping neat. Here, this is this sort of light. Uh, it would look a bit nice in here, but wouldn't do much good for doing these flipping videos. Yeah, so I'm, I'm gonna go now. Enjoy the rest of this miserable Sunday and uh, eat those. I'm gonna enjoy the vegetarian ones. Well, if it weren't for the chicken oil. But if it wasn't for that, the vegetarian ones. I'm not going to finish that tea because it's cold and there's nothing worse than bloody cold tea. So enjoy the rest of your Sunday. If you're somewhere where it, you're the beginning of your Sunday, I hope it's a damn sight better than our one was. But have fun anyway. Mm -hmm.